Hey, what's up? It's your boy, Sean Fit, man. Everybody, make sure y'all like and subscribe. Um, Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button real quick for me. But I just want to touch on that um Bob Aaron video that he did on Fight Hub TV, man. What y'all think about that? If y'all haven't seen it, um, go to Fight Hub TV and then check it out. Um, But basically, man, Bob Aaron is saying that he's kind of disgusted by how cautious Danny Garcia and Keith Thurman fought in their championship uh, unification bout that happened a few weeks ago. Um, yeah, man, I, I felt where he was coming from, man. He said they played a cautious fight. They had a huge um, audience, 5.1 plus million viewers, plus the people that were in the arena. You know what I'm saying? You got that type of platform. If you're trying to get people to love boxing, you should be letting those hands go a lot more than um, they were, man. Danny Garcia held back. Keith Thurman started holding back and started moving a lot more um, towards the closer ends of the fight when he first started out he was boxing you know he was doing his thing but it's just crazy man i'm gonna let y'all hear this a little clip it uh snippet of the interview real quick that's totally for boxing schmucks it means nothing to me i mean when two guys get in the ring and they have a big audience because it's on network television and they fight each of them the most cautious fight that i've seen who the hell cares about unification, no unification. I mean, I go from an era when Hearns and Leonard fought, and boy, they didn't hold back. They let go, both Tommy and Ray. And that's what fighters owe to the public, not to fight these bullshit, cautious fights where nothing happens. Yeah, man. So I I hear what he's saying, man. I feel him, especially as a as a tr boxing a boxer myself and um a fan of boxing, a long time fan of boxing, man. Just let them hands go, cause you listen to the build up of the fight, the build up of the fight, man. You hear Keith Thurman saying, "Danny Garcia, you going down, boy." You know what I'm saying? Danny Garcia talking his smack, Angel Garcia talking his smack, and then the fight come finally fight night. You got 5.1 million plus people watching y'all, and y'all start doing this cautious ass fighting, man. Y'all start pacing yourself. Y'all start doing all this bull crap, but all that hype to the fight. You think anybody else gonna wanna, you know, believe what y'all saying coming up in the next up and coming fights, or even put you in there with somebody like Pacquiao? Pacquiao like to come forward and like to let his hands go. You know, he ain't with the um, chasing nobody around the ring. You know what I'm saying? It's different if you use it full work and you pop, 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 and then move and pop, 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 like Lomachenko. Lomachenko goes in, man. He uses full work, but he always lets his hands go the entire fight until he gets the knockout or all the way to the end and bell, man. You don't never see him doing that, skipping around the ring stuff without letting his hands go. You got to let your hands go, man. That it, it makes it a for a boring fight because people come to see boxing for people to box hit and not get hit not just not get hit like you can't hit and not get hit if both of y'all are not swinging you somebody has to let their hands go so i feel what bob aram saying man what y'all think about the interview like i said go to fight hub tv check out the interview it's about a minute and 45 seconds long it's your boy sean fit make sure y'all subscribe to my instagram at sean fit and make sure y'all subscribe to the youtube peace out